what you're looking at is a miracle. When we started Grace Toronto 11 years ago, we dreamed of being a community that would invite people in to hear about the grace of God and Jesus, that discipled each other so well that we would be joy-filled ambassadors of God's love in every area of our life, that would train leaders to multiply expressions of the gospel throughout the city and the nation. But we never really imagined, even in our biggest dreams, that God would give us a building in the heart of the city that was such a perfect home to express those dreams. But we're home. Look around this building. The basement has been lowered four feet. The waterproofing is almost completely done. All the HVAC, all the plumbing, all the electricity, the new walls, it's almost all completed. The contractors are telling us that we're in the final part of construction, what they call the finishing phase. And that's where we are in this campaign. Finishing well is our phase. And we wanna do that together. We need new pews, new paint, new flooring. That's an extra $265,000. We've had some cost overruns because of all the work that had to be done to make this old building new again. That's about $160,000. We need a new contingency to catch any cost overruns for the last part. Together that makes $525,000 that we still need to raise over and above what we'd originally committed. But we can do it because God isn't finished with us. The miracle continues. This is how I think God is calling us to finish well. I think he's calling those of us who pledge to finish our pledges. If we do that, we'll get over $150,000 by the end of August. I think God is calling those of us who pledge to give above and beyond what we originally committed. I think and pray that we'll see another $250,000 come out of that. And I'm praying that that happens by December 31st. And there's a whole new group of us who haven't pledged or who are new to the church who want to join this adventure of God's miracle in the heart of the city. And we're hoping you'll join in and we can see 125,000 come in again, praying by the end of December. God has brought us this far. By grace, he'll bring us home. The leaders have already jumped at the opportunity to finish well. The leaders of your church have already committed to giving between 10 and 25% above what they'd originally committed. Would you join them? If you haven't been part of the campaign yet, would you join all of us in this adventure? Would you help us finish well this crazy miracle of making a place for grace in the heart of the city?